when they show up. So you're going to kind of get an extended family. <laughs> it's kind of like this person's a package deal. Maybe they got a kid and maybe they're taking care of a sick parent or an elderly parent. Collective, that's beautiful. But you all don't know this shit. <laughs> A lot of you do not know that straight fucking energy that's around you. My masculines, it could be a feminine energy around you, okay? Take, take the readings how they resonate. Don't get caught up in the sex. But, you know, over like 85% of my... Uh, Subscribers are feminine, so we pick up on that energy. A lot of you all do not even realize who the hell that one is coming in. Some of y'all have met this person. Some of y'all, remember, you might have to kiss a few frogs, so don't let your guard down. Keep your healthy boundaries. Whatever this toxic person taught you, whatever lessons you had to learn from the past, that's what's going to help you navigate and know which one is the correct one. Because the one that tried to do the most is going to absolutely bring you in the best. Karma. Because remember, who God has blessed, no man can curse. They might be able to delay things. Y'all go back and check some of them past readings. I've been telling you all for a long time. You got someone that's going to come in and save the fucking day. Someone that's going to come in and save the day. Because this person... <sighs> this person means well. Triple sevens. You're going to hit the jackpot. You're going to hit the jackpot. While you're hitting the jackpot, others are going to be uh, losing out. As you gain, they lose. Still page of wands because your person still has business to take care of. We've had the five of swords here, the five of cups in reverse, and the five of wands. So this is like major changes, not just in your life, but in whoever the hell is coming toward you. Things will happen when they're meant to come together. And a lot of it is people leaving toxic relationships, toxic ways of living, toxic habits. Starting with the man in the mirror. I'm starting with the man in the mirror. I'm asking him to change his ways. And no message could have been any clearer. If you want to make the world a better place, take a look at yourself and make the change. Now this is a reading for those that have done the work. This is a reading for those who have... Done the inner work, guys. Whether you did that on your own through spirituality or you got assistance through uh, a therapist, guidance, pastor, whatever uh, helped you along. It's taking the bad and learning from it to create something good. Y'all, I did a beautiful reading yesterday and I really... It's the only one I actually saved because I loved it, but I really felt it was a little more personal for me, which kind of freaked me the fuck out. That don't happen. But there is a song that I, I couldn't get the song. I knew what the song was, but I couldn't like think of the words. And when I got done with the reading and I watched it back and then I looked up the song that was uh, popping in my head, it's like, ooh. I was kind of more for daddy. So I was like, oh shit.
There's good coming in. But you're not always supposed to know. And remember, snap, uh, tarot's a snapshot in time. It's an energy picture, right? There's always free will at play. People got to do what they got to do in order to keep that ball mo moving. So go out. Live your life. Just live your life. Instead of chasing the paper, just live your life. Do what you got to do. Find your happiness. Find your peace. Keep manifesting, because y'all are calling the one in. You can ring my bell, ring my bell, ring a ring a ring. And definitely send love and light to anyone that you feel needs it in your life. Keep that karmic channel open. Because that's how you get rewarded. That's how you get rewarded. Kill them with kindness. Kill them with kindness. Peace, love, and light.